no non muslim uh, ladies uh, but we have a reverse sister so uh, if the uh, chairperson uh, permits could we allow okay. her okay we'd allow that assalamu alaikum my name is mariam sharif i am from ireland and a physical therapist by profession alhamdulillah i got a chance to be accept islam but my question is my father never got the chance and shirk is the biggest sin and i want to know if there is a specific dua or something i can read on his name so that his sin will be forgiven so so that's the question that alhamdulillah she accepted islam and she says that unfortunately her father he died as a mushrik so can i read any dua anything in his name so that sin can be forgiven sister the quran says in surah nisa chapter number 4 verse number 48 surah nisa chapter number 4 verse number 116 that if allah pleases he may forgive any sin but the sin of shirk he will never forgive because a person who has done shirk has committed the most heinous sin so except for shirk any other sin if the person is doing shirk and before he dies if he repents inshallah allah will forgive but if he dies as a mushrik he is destined for hell there is no other option and this is also narrated in the quran when ibrahim may please be upon him prophet ibrahim when he prays for his father who was a mushrik then a verse was revealed that when the person is alive you can ask allah to give hidayah to your parents to your father to your mother to your brother may allah guide them to the straight path but if they die as a mushrik and if you know that as a mushrik you cannot pray for them you can only pray that oh my god oh my lord allah make for my offspring muslims who will submit their will to allah and this is the dua of ibrahim alayhi salam his father also was a mushrik by the dua in surah hajj chapter number 22 the last few verses he prays that make my offsprings those who would submit the will to allah who will be muslims and we find that both these children ishmael alayhi salam and ishaq alayhi salam both of them became messengers of allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so what i request to you sister you make a dua to allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that may your offsprings be the one who will submit the will to allah and be on the straight path hope that answers the question